Well, today, four Grosbeck siblings received a surprise scholarship and a new home after their parents died in a car crash. Fox 44 Shaquille Omari gives us an inside view. Adam, since that horrible crash, the siblings have been split up, living with different family members. For the first time in more than a year, they will all be under this roof. Now, earlier today, all the excitement took place outside. On this Grosbeck lawn, a stream of tears flowed, followed with hugs after the community rallied together, presenting the Ferguson family with a surprise $20,000 scholarship. But the ultimate shock was a brand new home. They did a really good job of keeping it secret from you. Back in January 2019, their parents, Joanna and Daryl Ferguson, were tragically killed in a car crash. The four children were sent to live with their grandmother, but tragedy struck once again as she lost her home during the holidays. My thought was, how are these kids going to be strong? I mean, they've, they've lost everything. And Forcing the kids to be split up, sent to live with family and friends. But today, it's a new beginning. Like I miss just a simple lifestyle, not, not having to be separated from my family or having to make a phone call to reach out just to see how, how my brother or sister is doing. To make this happen, family friends Toby and Brandy began fundraising. Getty dinner at a local <laughs> restaurant that turned into this huge benefit in three weeks. After raising more than $40,000, the Cayley Foundation contacted them a charity that promotes seatbelt safety. Well, I just want them, I want them to be able to be a family together. Uh, they deserve to be with each other as a family. The Fergusons say they're beyond grateful. It's been so hard, but, but with them and with everybody, especially our community, because this is a small town, everybody knows everybody. It's been, it's been such a relief in it. 18-year-old Bryson Ferguson says he plans to use a scholarship at Texas A&M, where he'll be studying dental hygiene. For now, in Grosbeck, Shaquille Omari, Fox 44 News.